Hey there, we have John Lieber joining us at Real Talk Media Studios. So welcome in, my friend. Thank you, May. You're welcome. You know, we're talking about the market. 2022 is a whole new year. Yep. What is the best type of property to buy, would you say? This, it, it's changed a lot since California made building ADUs so much easier and more streamlined. So for anyone that doesn't know, ADU stands for Accessory Dwelling Unit. And it's basically a granny flat or a second rental unit is how many people are using them to put on their property that was normally zoned just for a single family house. Um, so the restrictions used to be a lot a lot higher in these and now they've really uh, statewide opened it up to where you can pretty much squeeze an ADU anywhere on a single family lot as long as certain minimums are met. Um, the, the benefit in this is that some jurisdictions initially said, well, you have to live in, live in one of the two houses yourself, and then you're allowed to rent out the other property that you build. You can either rent out the ADU or the, or the main house, it doesn't matter which. Um, but that's really gone away. So what this has allowed people to do is buy a single family house, put a second dwelling on it, and rent out both. And for, for ease of math purposes, um, if you put a thousand square foot dwelling, you can build for say three hundred dollars a foot. It costs you three hundred thousand dollars to build this this second house in your property. You can likely rent this place out for three thousand dollars a month, give or take, anywhere in the county. Um, if you look at what's comparable to that, it would cost you say six or seven hundred thousand dollars to buy it the same house on its own and rent that out for the same amount. Mm -hmm. So you're really investing in something at half the cost that you would if you were to go buy something new. Um, so what it's done is, in San Diego, most investors are buying and getting maybe a three and a half to 4% return if they go out and buy a multi-unit property, apartments, um, a single family house. You can build your ADU and get maybe a 10 to 12% return on that, and your combined return is somewhere in the seven to ten percent range. So the savvy investors that I've seen that have been doing this have been buying a single family house, putting an ADU on, renting both, and your your combined return is going to be in the seven to ten percent range. Great. An awesome return in this tight market. Right, right, yeah. fantastic. And essentially could pay for partial uh, mortgage, your partial mortgage on oh, your yeah. home as you, well. Oh you, yeah, you would, if you did that, you could likely cover most or all of your mortgage by putting an ADU on. Right. Great. So, okay. and, and then hold on to that property forever. And that's, you know, that's a great rental property. That's really how I got started with things. So um, that's, you know, if, if someone wants to do this, I would say, let me know. I can help you do this. I've, I've been around this for, for many years and can help you navigate through the right property and, and figuring out, putting on an ADU. So you're the right person to talk to about this. Yes. Which is a great way to pay for your, or to cover your mortgage costs. Yep. Or, or it's just an simply investment. an investment. Right. Yeah. Great. Well, thank you so much, John. Thank you. That was John Lee for joining us at Real Talk Media Studios.